Hey everybody, Joby Miho here, and welcome to another unboxing. Now this is April's Loot Crate, and I know it's the middle of May, but uh, I've tried recording this one four times in April. I was having problems with this webcam right here. If you watch my streams, click the link below. You, <laughs> you'll know that um, it's been acting up, but I, I, got a, I think I got it fixed. I think maybe it was a driver issue or something. I don't know. Seems good. I couldn't use my other camera because the new computer I built, I didn't put any multimedia ports, so SD cards and stuff like that wouldn't work. I have an adapter now, but you know it's just so much easier using the webcam. Without further ado, though, we're a month late. Here's the loot crate. Now, it's your basic loot crate. Nothing too special. The box is the box. And if you open her up, you got a little, you know, document share and joy. You gotta do that. But the first thing I was greeted by, and I think this is how, kind of how it went when I first did it, is a t-shirt. It's a nice t-shirt. I think it's Dungeons and Dragons, the new Dungeons and Dragons symbol. Oh, I can't even see it. There she is. So, that's uh, yeah, a nice t-shirt. It's a decent t-shirt. Um, you also get this. It is a crown that you could wear because you are the king. There you go. It's a blow-up crown, and I just blew it up. Look at that. Look magnificent. Just, just magnificent. Um, <laughs> one of the main things I like in this one is this. It's Harry Potter nine and three quarters bag tag. That's what it is. I'm a Harry Potter fan, so I I do like this a lot. Um, I've never seen Game of Thrones. I never plan on seeing it, but they give you Game of Thrones magnets. Thank you. Don't know. I I know. I've seen this symbol before, and maybe this one. I don't. I don't know. I don't give a shit. They also give you a. Black Tie Geek, uh, you got that Space Invader ones last time, this this week you get a Dungeons and Dragons bow tie. Kind of neat. I can dig that, I don't know if I'll ever wear it, but I got it. Game of Thrones. Stark Signal. So, um, it's the symbol again from Game of Thrones, which again, I don't watch, but here it is. And it's a USB drive. I don't believe there's anything on this. I think it's just a 4 gigabyte one or something. But still kind of neat, I guess. Uh, you get the typical Loot Crate badge. Loot Crate badge. I said... Well, anyway, yeah, they're focused a little bit. Just, you know, your typical Loot Crate badge. You get these, the Princess's Bride playing cards. And that is what they are. They are playing cards. They have some nice designs on them, but it's a deck of playing cards. And then you get the, uh, the owner's manual, you know. What kind of crap did we give you this month? I'm going to say this right now, and I don't know if you can tell by the tone of my voice. I'm, I'm quite a bit disappointed with this month's Loot Crate. Um... Really, the only thing I like, I don't think I'm missing anything, is the 9 and 3 quarters bag tag. That's not worth um, the $30 price tag. Oh, and, and the t-shirt, I guess, is nice. So, there's that. But, yeah, this month's, uh, if I didn't mention it, this month's, or a April's month uh, loot crate is fantasy. You just get your typical, here's some stuff to read if you want. Um, and... Oh, GTX 980. Shit. The Mega Crate was pretty good. I like the bag tag. So it is a Dungeons & Dragons t-shirt. Um, some guy wearing the crown. The magnet set. The cards. That's it. And then I think the box folds and you can make like a, I don't know, a table with a map on it. But um, let's go and price everything out. This USB flash drive. I would probably price it at about 10 bucks. 10 bucks is probably... What we would, what we would pay in Canada anyway, for something like this. So there's ten. A uh, deck of cards. I'll put. I'm gonna put five bucks on the deck of cards. So that's fifteen. 
Uh, 10 bucks for the tie. 25. 5 bucks for that. 30. Priceless. I'm not going to even put a price on this. So, that's uh, priceless. This is probably another 10. That's 40. And probably 15, 20 bucks for the t-shirt. So you still get the value of everything. The value is still there. Um, but like I said, I think this is one of the weaker loot crates. I don't think everybody thinks the way I do. <clears throat> but for me, anyways, eh, I have arcade blocks on box next. I don't know what's in there, so I'm pretty excited about that. But that being said, thank you for watching, everybody. And, uh, you know, like the video. It makes me feel good on the inside, the outside, and in the crotch area. Make sure you press that like button if you like the video. Um, comment, let me know what you think. The setting's a little different. I might have to change it up a little bit. And, you know, subscribe so you don't miss anything. I do live stream announcements. I do unboxings. I do Let's Plays. You know, come join me for some fun. But once again, thank you for watching, everybody, and I'll see you all again next time.